Great job by leaving the business in your hands. I know. Thanks, honey, for taking care of your father's businesses. <laughs> yeah, welcome, honey. Thanks, honey. I knew you would like it. <laughs> mm. I've got something for you. After eight years, you still look young and beautiful as the day I married you. Yes. <laughs> Even you too, Jenna. You still look the same. Aha. Hmm. Happy anniversary, love. Happy anniversary, babe. How was your day? Same old, boring. Yours? No, not that much. I went out for a shopping, soon came back home to prepare the food. Interesting. Interesting? I mean shopping, of course. Even after eight years, I still can't read your eyes. Yet I always sense them when you want to say something, but you don't. It's nothing, really. I guess what my heart really wants is the truth. To tell me stuff that you never said to me because you fear that my heart won't handle it. Razi, I've always been honest with you. I know. So. Nice dress. Is it new? Nice shirt. I love your smile. I love your tie. It's red and blue. <laughs> I thought I should wear it today, you know, since it's our special day, you know. 
I want a divorce. A divorce? How long have you been thinking about it? A long time. How long? Since we moved in here. But I thought you were happy. I thought we were happy. Happy? I was happy. Well, yes. This is not enough, now. Say something about that. Okay? I hate that shirt and that red tie. But you just said you left a few minutes ago. God, I just wish you could open up to me and tell me what you think I'm not happy. Talk to me. I hate how you look at me. How you lick your lips every two minutes. I hate how your breath stinks. That's just that gone, I'm listening. I hate how you snore. I hate how you bite your teeth every two minutes and make a noise. It's annoying. Is that on? No. What else? I've been fucking your friend. What? Which one? That's not important. Excuse me for wanting to know which, which one of my friends you are fucking. So, which one? Utabo. 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 Luazo, say something. Why? See what I mean? You're not a man, Luazo. Just for once, say how you really feel. What do you want me to say? What can anyone say in this kind of situ situation? Why no more there? Why what? More wine, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Thank you. So, you hate this shirt and this red tie and this tie. I always thought you loved them. So you've been fucking my best friend? Yep. <laughs> that motherfucker. He's going to kill me. So, what were you doing? Here, in my place, or his house? Sometimes in here. Sometimes in his place when his wife is away. In my house? When you are gone. You fucked him in my house? <laughs> wow. Wow. I only thought you were a witch. But not a bitch. You fucked my best friend under my roof? Shit. So, what are you doing here? In. In the couch, in, in, in this table, in, in the counter, where exactly? Are you sure you wanna know? Just tell me where. <laughs> Ooh, sometimes in the bathroom, sometimes in this couch, sometimes in this table, and yes, sometimes in our bedroom. <laughs> Are you okay, honey? Are you fine? I'm fine. <laughs> Must be the wine. It's not the wine. It's food. Have I ever told you that I hate your cooking? It makes my stomach turn. Are you sure it's my cooking, not the truth? Yes, I'm sure, love. So, <laughs> you're doing it here in my kitchen. No wonder I hate your cooking. God, you're so disgusting. Why did I marry you? So is it, is it sex that makes you want to divorce me? Eat and other stuff. Other stuff? He's good, I guess. Is he really that good? He is bigger and better. <coughs> so you were doing it here in my kitchen? Table and the floor and the counter. How exactly? Tell me how. Sometimes in this counter. Help me get one, sweetie. And 
then he would rip out my panties and take me from behind. And he drives deep in me. Come, help me get off. And then he would touch me just like that. Come, dear husband, feel free to touch me. And then he would touch me just like that and take me from behind. And he drives deep in me. Does he make you come? Yes. Especially when he is doing me at this position. I come as many and I lose track of how many. But, but you hardly come and we... Well, it is because I never told you how much you suck. You had the last and had to say hard. Your little junior down there is disgustingly small for me. Eating your food is it really that bad? <laughs> I parents are coming over next weekend. Who invited them? They invited themselves. Surely I did. So you didn't even bother to ask me. As if you bothered to ask me. So this is what it's all about? Yes. Maybe no. Hmm. Since we're putting all our cards on the table, I might as well show you mine. How oh, fucked you, sister? What? What's in Z? You are an only. That little... Are you okay, Rami? I'm Rami? fine. Remember when she had a fight with her husband and she came to stay with us? One night I came home from work and then she was sitting here all alone, drinking wine and eating some food. My wine and my food? Be careful, honey. I might start thinking that you're jealous. You wish. <laughs> so I come home and then she was sitting here, crying. And then I asked her what was wrong, and then she told me this long, boring story about how much she misses her husband. And then we embrace this long hug. And then before I knew it, I must say, Lola, she can fuck a man. I sometimes wonder maybe I made the wrong choice and I married the wrong sister. Missionary portion can be a turn off, not of his love. None taken. So, we did it four times at night, and then when we were done, I came to our room, and then you wanted to have sex with me, but I couldn't get it up because I was so tired of fucking. <laughs> Ever since that night, our sex life has never been the same. Every time I'm having sex with you, I imagine it's here that I'm fucking, and then I lose control. <laughs> More wine, love? No, I'm fine. I insist. And shortly after that, she was pregnant. And the hair spent and hair wanted to work things out. Me and her, we know that that, my baby, my, that baby is mine. But you, her husband, and the rest of the family knows a different story. Wow. Look who's growing some balls. I must say, I like this new you. I must say thanks to you, love. So, I said, I know, I know, I said it was okay for you not to be able to bear me children. But tell me, what kind of a man doesn't want to have kids? The truth is, I have one outside of this horrible marriage. Are you okay, love? I'm fine. What? Mm -hmm. Sexual, I still check it. Every now and then. Me and her, we never apart. Last year when you got pregnant and then you lost the baby. 
Are you telling me I want to do the dishes? Thanks God, I thought you never asked. You take that shit. The wine. Okay, you. Have I ever told you that? That person you feel smells like shit. And that people and away you love it so much that things all the time just throw it away for God's sake. So your parents are coming off this weekend? Yep. She hates me, Lassie. What makes you say that? I see the way she looks at me. She hates me. I guess you have tolerated it throughout the weekend like you always do all these years. I guess I'll have to do that. Do you hate me, Lassie? I never hate you even if I try. Take me. Take me. I don't know, Razi. I think time has happened. Do you think maybe this will be another time to Chance? I don't know, Razi. I want to believe that. I have to. You hate me. I could never hate you. You are the first man that I've ever truly loved. So? Oh. Well, what did you say? It gave me best. It gave me best moments in my life. Joy and happiness. For all it's worth, Razi, you showed me love. Do you think? Do you really want a divorce? Yes, I do, Lassie. Was it really that bad? Like I said, Lassie, these type of questions will only make it hard. Let's just call it what it is. What it is? What is it, no more? Help it's me to understand. It's a failed marriage, Lassie. That hurts? To want to think that you want to believe that your opponent lied. That was a child's time. But the best moments of true love, no more, yeah. <laughs> what? What, what? What are you laughing at? Are you sure you want to know? Tell me! This time I saw you, Lord Lonely. She's like... You're like a like sun rising in the morning with a smile to die for. Those beautiful eyes. Lord your eyes, no wonder your smile, everything together. No wonder before I met you, I there was no one, I had nothing, no car, no house, nothing. Stop it, you are saying. No wonder you are a better half. Together we are intertwined, no wonder. Talk to me, open up to me, no wonder. Talk to me. I did my hair to you, and I'm sure you didn't even notice that. But that's not the point. What is the point, you are You never notice me. Do you know how much time I spend on the mirror just to look good for you? I even shave, Lazi, for you. Your hair looks nice. I was going to say that. But that's not the point. The point here is that you have changed. I don't know you anymore. Okay, what else did I do? In some way, I think. You see what I mean, Lazi? What? You never notice me, Lazi. Come on, no more, Dad. No more, you're not the same. You are so heartless and you are so cold and heartless. Talk to me, no more, What happened to you? It's coming to happen to me. I like most women out there, God gave me a glimpse of hope on how to carry a child. I felt it kicking in my knee, but then he took it away from me. Not only he took it away from me, he took all the chances of me having children. I'm not a complete woman, right? Yes, you are. Man. I'm not. But then, if you remember, Yes, I remember you were there. I even remember the way you looked at me. It was though as you blamed me, Razi, for losing our child. As though as you hated me. Your mother, Razi, your father. They were there. They wanted grandkids and we, I, Razi, I could not give them. Stop the money. Stop what, Razi? You wanted the truth, but now you cannot handle it. What? 
Why the money? What do you want me to say? And the doctor told us that you are pregnant on Monday. I was so happy. And then he told me it was a boy. I dreamed of the moment of me and him playing soccer in our backyard. Then you lost him. You lost him no more. When you lost him no more, you lost a part of me. You lost our dream. You lost my dream no more. Divorce me, man. Divorce me, man, and find another woman. Have kids with her, marry her. Saying that no more. Have family together. Because that's what I cannot offer you. A woman to you, a woman enough. No, brother, I'm not a complete woman, brother. I'm not. Sister, I'm sure you like that. You just, you just talk to me about them. Can we just dance for the last time, just the two of us? Every morning and every night, same and same sweet little things to you. Sounds tempting, but I cannot have children. It's not the kids that I seek. I seek company. Someone will spend the rest of my life. With. Someone will walk in hand in hand. Someone will die next to me, and then I'll die next to me. Well, in that case, welcome Loazi in my life. He planned this all along. No, happy first anniversary. Okay. <laughs> I, I am the mother of 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 the Till, Till death do us apart. apart.